I'm Bridget, it's Friday, and this is TV Squad Daily. So, super random Friday just so happened to fall on November 9th, National Chaos Never Dies Day. I didn't make that one up. According to some people, these are pictures of what chaos looks like. Chaos is cute. Huh. Super random cat action. Super random. Have you ever gotten a new coat, and then every time you wear it, it just makes you feel super friendly? Happened to me. Mm, that's all I got. Your turn. Day 5 of the writer's strike. The cast of ER has decided to take the financial well-being of their writers personally. The cast is putting together a bunch of fundraisers to support the writers while they're not working. ER's writers worked around the clock before the strike so that they would have as many episodes possible to shoot, but it's still not enough for a whole season. John Stamos said that this strike could actually turn out to be a good thing for ER, that it could lead to a whole nother full season of the show. So, no big plans this weekend? Feeling a little sorry for yourself? Don't, because things could be worse. Do you remember the actress Jan Smithers? Maybe not. He's probably best known for starring in the show WKRP in Cincinnati, back in the day, way back. She had a really bad day recently. Okay, so she was driving her car, naked. Driving naked, in the middle of the night, in the middle of nowhere, and her car broke down. Don't laugh, because it gets worse. So, still naked of course, she gets out of her car to try to flag down a passing truck for help, and the truck hits her. Really? This happened back in September, but all the details are just now coming out. She's okay, but it's taking her a long time to get over all the injuries. Anyway, so the cops could never find anything wrong with her car, she couldn't remember anything about the accident, and she had no idea why she would have been driving around naked in the middle of the night. Poor Jan. So I'm just saying, if you didn't just get hit by a truck naked, things aren't that bad. So this might be the worst show idea ever. A&E is going to have a whole show about... Garage Sales of the Stars. Ileana Douglas, who you might recognize from Ugly Betty or Factory Girl, is going to host and help at these garage sales where famous people try to get money for their old crap. It's no secret that I have a problem with these things. Garage sales where celebrities sell their stuff, even if it's for charity. Because when you break it down, it's still people with a lot of money just getting rid of crap they don't want anyway, and then people with not as much money giving the money to charity. And then every time the celebrities get a pat on the back for giving money to charity, but it totally wasn't them, it was the people that bought their crap. Ugh. So the series pilot covers Tom Arnold's garage sale. He raised about $5,000 for charity. Good job, people that bought Tom's old crap. I swear, I feel like I'm the only person that this seems messed up to. Where's my happy coat? I can't stay mad while I'm wearing this coat. See you Monday.